group of us friends get together every Sunday morning called the Anonymous Society of Artists. And why is it called the Anonymous Society of Artists? I have no idea. But we all get together and we sketch and paint and have a good time. This morning we're at the Leitner Museum here in beautiful St. Augustine, Florida. I'm going to be using acrylics today and I'm going to paint this scene right here. It's very, very foggy this morning so I don't think my paints are going to dry very quickly, but I'm going to get started. This won't be a painting demonstration. I'll do a little time-lapse photography here for you so you can see the progress really quickly. I'm using a 9 by 12 inch piece of masonite covered with gesso and I'm sketching the subject in using charcoal. I'm using acrylics and my palette consists of titanium white, cerulean blue, ultramarine blue, Indian yellow, cadmium yellow light, cadmium red light, and alizarin crimson. Okay, let's speed things up. Here I'm starting with my dark colors first. These are transparent colors, which means my Indian yellows ultramarine blue and alizarin crimson. Those will give me rich dark colors. So after I placed in all my darks using the transparent colors, I started with my light colors using my opaque colors and some white. I don't think I've ever painted anywhere where it's been as moist and damp as it was today. So using the acrylics was a real challenge. They just stayed wet for the entire painting process. Normally the acrylics dry quickly and then I can put another coat of paint over them or put another glaze over them. But I couldn't do it in this case because it was just so damp and foggy. I very seldom paint a composition like this that's so symmetrical, but uh, I like the courtyard here, so I thought I'd give it a try. It does leave me with a bit of a handicap, though, because anything symmetrical is not as interesting as things that aren't. Mm -hmm. 